Little Patriots Kids Corner would not be possible without the support of our awesome partners. Thank you, Dominion Energy and Cox for being a force behind the forces. Hello and welcome to Kids Corner with the USO. I am Karen. Uh, and I'm Janelle. We, today we are gonna do the germy hand experiment. So what we're gonna do first is we're gonna have Atticus take the crayon. We're gonna have you draw on this hand what you think germs look like. Uh. And while he's drawing, we'd like to thank a couple of our sponsors, Cox and Dominion Energy, for all they do to support us and our servicemen and women in the area. Okay. All right. So this is what Atticus thinks germs look like on your hand. So what we're going to do is we mix together some hand sanitizer and glitter, and we're going to see what germs actually look like. Okay, ready? Make sure it gets in there good. Okay. It's really sticky. It is really sticky. <laughs> all right, ready? And then one, two. <gasps> wow, wow, look, look at, at that. Germs. Do they look different than you thought? Yes. Okay. Uh, tiny germs inside. You have ter <laughs> tiny germs that get inside. You're right. All right, that ends today's Thank kids' you. corner. Thank you. Thanks, Atticus. See, welcome. Welcome. Okay. <laughs> Stay tuned for a reading with our friends at Scholastic. Come on, rain. Come on, rain, I say squinting into the endless heat. Mama lifts a listless vine in size. Three weeks and not a drop, she says, sagging over her parched plants. The sound of a heavy truck rumbles past. Uneasy, Mama looks over to me. Is that thunder, Tessie? She asks. Mama hates thunder. I climb up the steps for a better look. It's just a truck, Mama, I say. I am sizzling like a hot potato. I ask Mama, May I put on my bathing suit? Absolutely not, Mama says, frowning under her straw hat. You'll burn all day out in this sun. Up and down the block, cats pant. Heat wavers off tar patches in the broiling alleyway. Ms. Grace and Ms. Vera bend tending beds of drooping lupins. Not a sign of my friends Liz or Rosemary. Not a peep from my pal Jackie Joyce. I stare out over rooftops, past chimneys, into the way off distance. And that's when I see it coming. Clouds rolling in. Gray clouds bunched and bulging under a purple sky. A creeper of hope circles round my bones. Come on, rain, I whisper. Quietly, while Mama weeds, I cross the crackling dry path past Ms. Glick's window, glancing inside as I hurry by. Ms. Glick's needle sticks on her phonograph, playing the same notes over and over. 
in the dim, stuffy cave of her room. The smell of hot tar and garbage bullies the air as I climb the steps to Jackie Joyce's porch. Jackie Joyce, I breathe, pressing my nose against her screen. Jackie Joyce comes to the door. Her long legs, like two brown string beans, sprout from her shorts. It's going to rain, I whisper. Put on your suit and come straight over. Slick with sweat, I run back home and slip up the steps past Mama. She is nearly senseless in the sizzling heat, kneeling over the hot rump of a melon. In the kitchen, I pour iced tea to the top of a tall glass. I aim a spoonful of sugar into my mouth, then a second into the drink. Got you some tea, Mama, I say, pulling her inside the house. Mama sinks onto a kitchen chair and sweeps off her hat. Sweat trickles down her neck and wets the front of her dress and under her arms. Mama presses the ice chill glass against her skin. Aren't you something, Tessie, she says. I nod smartly. Rain's coming, Mama, I say. Mama turns to the window and sniffs. It's about time, she murmurs. Jackie Joyce, in her bathing suit, knocks at the door, and I let her in. Jackie Joyce has her suit on, Mama, I say. May I wear mine, too? I hold my breath, waiting. A breeze blows the thin curtains into the kitchen, then sucks them back against the screen again. Is there thunder, Mama asks. No thunder, I say. Is there lightning, Mama asks. No lightning, Jackie Joyce says. You stay where I can find you, Mama says. We will, I say. Go on then, Mama says, lifting the glass to her lips to take a sip. Come on, rain, I cheer peeling out of my clothes and into my suit while Jackie Joyce runs to get Liz and Rosemary. We meet in the alleyway. All the insects have gone still. Trees sway under a swollen sky. The wind grows bold and bolder. And just like that, rain comes. The first drops plop down big, making dust dance all around us. Then a deeper gray descends, and the air cools, and the clouds burst. And suddenly, rain is everywhere. Come on, rain! Come on, rain! We shout. Come on, rain! It streams through our hair and down our backs. It freckles our feet, glazes our toes. We turn in circles, glistening in our rain skin. Our mouths wide, we gulp down rain. Jackie Choice chases Rosemary, who chases Liz, who chases me. Wet slicking our arms and legs, we splash up the block, squealing and whooping in the streaming rain. We make such a racket. Ms. Glick rushes out on her porch. Ms. Grace and Ms. Vera come next. And then comes Mama. 
they run from their kitchens and skid to a stop. Leaning over their rails, they turn to each other. A smile spreads from porch to porch. And with a wordless nod, first one, then all. Bling off their shoes, skim off their hose, tossing streamers of stockings over their shoulders. Our bare-legged mamas dance down the steps and join us in the fresh, clean rain, while the music from Ms. Glick's phonograph shimmies and sparkles and streaks like night lightning. Jackie Joyce, Liz, Rosemary, and I, we grab the hands of our mamas. We twirl and sway them, tromping through puddles, romping and reeling in the moisty green air. We swing our wet and wild-haired mamas till we're all laughing under trinkets of silver rain. I hug Mama hard, and she hugs me back. The rain has made us new. As the clouds move off, I trace the drips on Mama's face. Everywhere, everyone, everything is misty limbs springing back to life. We sure did get a soaking, Mama, I say. And we head home, purely soothed, fresh as dew, turning toward the first sweet rays of the sun.